Hello and welcome back to another first hour impressions. And today is uh, Resident Evil, Resident Evil Village, to be more precise. Um, we'll get straight into it, I suppose. Yeah, um, we're going to put the subtitles on for you guys. Output audio. We're going to put TV head head surround sound TV. We'll put headphones. Um, yeah, that's what I've got now. So, <laughs> okay. Uh, continue with these settings. Yes. Play in HDR mode. Uh, I am going to. So hopefully. And just this. Hang on. What square? Oh, I see. <laughs> I see. I think it's really about there for me. You probably won't be able to see it. Uh, until the both blue and red lines area are the same. I mean, that that's it for me. Okay, data processing. Um, right stick? Yeah, right stick's got to go read all this. Uh, you won't be able to play it unless we press yes, so we'll have to press yes. Would you like to watch a recap of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard, Biohazard Story? Recommended for those who have not played the Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. So I'm, do you know what, I watched the end of uh, my last stream and I kind of, I kind of, it sort of makes sense to me, but I'm going to watch it anyway. We'll include this in the uh, uh, in the review. Okay. I mean, it's part of it, I suppose. Where to start? Here we go. <clears throat> My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. My. I got an email from her. She, was she told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. Creepy. I found Mia being held captive in a dark Mia, basement. Maya. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. Mm. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. Welcome to the family, son. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. Yeah, so that's right at the end when you're I going towards the fucked up family. And was able to treat me as symptoms with a serum. The little girl there. The last boss fight, which I remember dying at. <laughs> and then Chris Redfield coming down. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up. Yeah, and saved the both are. of us. And the little girl was actually the old woman. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. Huh? It's all over now. Okay. Interesting. Resident Evil Village. Um, so, we are going to start the game, I suppose. Um, I've not had a chance to sort out the audio. Ah, but there we go. So, right. Oh, it's display. What am I doing? There we go. So, voice, background, sound effects, menu, dynamic range. Hmm, the virtual surround is off. Okay, I'm turning it on for you guys. Well, that's much better. Dynamic range will have large. Uh, we're going to turn everything down to three, apart from the voice. Oh, good. Handy. Right, so this should be a little bit quieter for you guys. Um. Control wise, we'll have the vibrations on. Control type, adaptive triggers on. Oh, A and B. So, control type A. Attack. Well, you know what? We'll probably go into this when we play. We'll see how it uh, plays. I suppose camera. Uh, camera inversion. Movement camera inversion. See, I swear I've got it as um, global. Oh well. Invert Y. But why? Menu. No, let's not do that. Let's just keep that one. Menu, non-movement, camera. 
movement camera speed, aiming speed, movement camera acceleration, mid mid, camera wobble on, motion sensor wobble. So just making sure this is right, movement camera inversion, movement camera, aiming camera inversion, yeah so it's the same. Cool, alright, game settings, aim assist on, damage display normal, test display, okay, yeah, reticle on, reticle colour white, display, you've seen that one, audio, you've seen that one, language, both English, subtitles are on, and yeah, let's go. Let's go! Okay, uh, test your average difficulty, we'll take it easy on you, we'll hit you with all we've got. Standard it is. Now, it's probably worth saying that I haven't played the demos, either of them. I've avoided ago, as much as I can. Went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He this is cool. Warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Well, this is all very, very creepy. <laughs> waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Bigger mistake. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Okay. Is it resident regal? Yes, we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only <laughs> six months old. That's what I was thinking. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. It's because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just She cautious. doesn't sound like she's recovered. Go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. Wait, what? It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. So, I'll go take... Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Oh, this looks good. I'm guessing this is upstairs? It is? Well, let's have a look around first, shall we? My lord, this is... This looks so good. Nice. Oh, hello. Examine. <laughs> the audio is amazing. I definitely, I can definitely pinpoint where things are. Oh, 
Oh no, that's where she is. Let's go further around this way. Hello. Once you're a big girl, we'll have a drink together, all right? <laughs> okay. Oh, another one. Mom got you another new book? The ABCs. All right, let's go. Let's, let's go around this way, shall we? Can I open this door? Yes, I can. I didn't press any buttons there. <clears> the <throat> front door. Close, there's nothing in there. They're there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Hmm, this house is very dark. Um Bathroom. This is nice. Here's medication. She's been on a strict regi regimen ever since the incident. Well, I'm not surprised. Okay. What's down here? Hey, Rose. Is there anything worth having a gander? Ah. I should get rid of it someday. Bubblehead. Just <laughs> gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Hello. Historical look at the architecture of Eastern European castles and keeps by George Trevor. Uh-huh. Curtain closes on Dolby gas incident. The committee completed their investigation to the 18th, on the 18th into the Duvet, Dolve toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded that the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the Murdoch under the area. Jack Baker and his family, who were exposed to the gas, perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but the current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area is being closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Well, there's a cover-up for you. Let's get out of this weird room. Do, do, do. Almost there, honey. Uh-huh. Okie dokie. Oh, this is our room. Hmm. Okay. Wedding. Cooking. Baby being born. Some scans. Alright, oh. I wish it could stay like this forever. Okay. Gun survivalist, a heavy firearms ma oh. uh, manual field combat situations by Joseph someone. <laughs> well hi there, little rose. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, hello. Name. Oh, it's a birth certificate. Uh, screen. Screenings. Hearing, vision, touch, reflex, test. All results show no issue. Patient is in good health. Uh, uh, results for the pathogen fungal test will be provided by BSAA. Okay. Me and I had another fight. February the 6th. I accidentally mentioned that well, what happened three years ago, and she blew up on me. We finally set down our new life in Europe, and we can bring Rose up properly. But I still feel part of the problem is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without hanging hang over our heads? 
We hear that to her much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have ex exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Rose is fine. Can't keep your mother waiting. She's scary when she's angry. Rose is closed for tomorrow. All right, in you go. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Okay. Ah, here we go. We can walk a little bit faster now. Do, 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 do. Feels quite smooth. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de la gum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But if you're going to keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. You're really worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- What? Mia, get down. Mia! What? What's going on? Is Chris a bad guy? Go on, move. All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Package? Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Well, this is a bit screwed up, isn't it? Hey, Doc. No problem. We'll be there. That was the doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. I, know. I hardly talk about anything else. Well, yeah, it's kind of a big thing. I'm telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's going to be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just Mia, won't. what are you talking about? Huh? Something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. What's she worried about? Out there. 
What are you talking about? Of course, Chris Redfield. And Rose. Who is this? Okay, we are back to we are back to working. We're whoa, hang on, what's happened here? These are footsteps, right? I guess I'm going this way. R three. That's creepy. Um. Ooh. Um, bear with me a second. Just need to do a speed test because my internet could be just about to crap out. I apologise. What's in here? Ah, oh, just out of stuff. Uh, am I going down?
getting very creepy vibes again. Well, hello. What is that? Is that a tree? Hmm. That's going to be when I turn around, isn't it? Am I supposed to go back outside again? Well, I can't go that way. Or can I? Can I move it? Oh, yes, I can. I don't know if I want to go out the front. This is creepy. The fuck? Maybe, maybe they're out. Okay, that's not good. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well, this is the only way I can go, so I'm assuming that I'm allowed to go this way without dying. Um, that's where noise is coming from. Hang on. Is there any blood on the floor? Okay, it looks like it's been dragged this way. Unless that's, unless that's not what I'm looking at. Yeah, that's freaky. How are you still working? If you look like you're not, you haven't been used in years. What happened? Hello. A badge on a gate. Do I, need, do I need a key to get in here? Yeah, it's locked. And no idea what that is. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. And the door is open. It's dark for me, so if it's dark for you as well, I'm not surprised. <laughs> Hello. I will pick up the knife. Right. Hang on. Right stick. Left, does that anything? Okay. Hold down the left stick, uh, left trigger, stab, or you can do that for just general wipes, swipes, <laughs> wipes. Did they just run out of the house? Hmm. Sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road. And... What's going on? Christ, he looks like he's seen a. <laughs> he's seen a lot. <laughs> I am leaving. Are you listening? Hey! Well, what the? Ooh. lovely. Okay, so I have 20 bullets and no patience. Begging to be seen. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, okay. Hang on. Jesus Christ. It's not the same face as the other one. What the hell is wrong with this place? Huh. Okay, maybe not. Something's moving over there. Ooh!
Well... Well... How do I get out of this one? We're not supposed to be doing this, am I? Where do I get out? Oh, I see. Hang on, what? Wow! That's my face. Oh, hello. Chem fluid. Can I get out of here? Can I get out of here? Herb. Oof. Okay, so I can view materials that can be used. Items can be crafted in the crafting menu. Change menus with L and R. Okay, combining materials to create new items. We have handgun arrow, first date. All right. Oh, trophy. Crafter. So what did I just craft there? Chem one chem fluid, one herb. Okay. I don't think I can do another, can I? Okay. Key items. Treasure. Items. So I've got one here. Fully heals all wounds. Can I can I beat this guy? Yes, I can. So it's the eighth. Not aimed down sights. ADS. All right. So I didn't really need all that. Um, to heal myself, but there you go. Let's have a look again in here. What, anything else? Anything else? No. Um, so I haven't got any. I haven't got the key. Um, I have come out of here. Is, that, is this where I was before? Bolt cutters. Yeah. Alright. This is probably where I need to get out. Um, we will have a look anyway around just to see if there's anything else I've missed. There's nothing up here. Nothing around here. No, that's where I was having a look before. Okay, let's just get out with the bolt cutters, shall we? Assuming there's a... Oh, there is a lock. It's quite difficult to see. Bolt cutters. There we go. All right, all right, all right. Freedom! So, can we go this way? Just a haystack, right? Just a haystack. Probably somewhere to kite an enemy around. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, okay, well, we'll go in anyway. Handgun ammo. Probably not a good place to be. None. Are they on the roof? Can barricade the door with shells. Okay. Gotta be careful here. 
was this chem fluids and okay you're gonna come through the roof oh crumbs you are how do I change weapons uh That's just the body, isn't it? Is there a back door here? There's nothing back there. Um, now what? Where do I go? Ah! Did not see there. Am I dead? No! Can very much do with reloading. You coming upstairs? Stay there. Is it over? Oh, he's gone. Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? Okay, survivors it is. Do I go back out the door? Don't think this is a good idea. Did I just hear a cat? It's locked from the other side. Okay. Um... can hear them all around me. Oh, hello. There's one up there. There's one over there. This is not a good place to go. There's one there. I don't know where I'm going. Is there a map? Okay, there is a map. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. I don't really have a a marker to sort of say where I'm supposed to be going, but um, I'm assuming there's this path here, and there's this path here, and there's this path here, so. Okay, there's one up there. Not a good place to be. Can't hear any this way, but this is where I just came from. I don't know where to go. So I just leg it? Is 
definitely not a good place to be. Can't go underneath. What is in that? Oh, my lord. It's one there, one here, one there. Gotta make a choice. I can't I can't do nothing. Let's have a look at the map slow. So uh, I've picked everything up on those two. I haven't been to this building here. I'm trying to remember where that was. So I've been through this building. Journal. Uh unexplored, currently searching complete. Does that mean, oh, that just means I can't go past through it. Surely. Does this mean I can unlock it? Yes, it does. Maybe I've got to just leg it round. Um... Where's he gone? Whoever it is. Okay. Oh no. Must have scrap. Damn it. Well, well, well. How do I get out of this? So what was that flower? Do I Can I blow it up? Are they following me underneath? Am I trying to get to that building up there? Oh, no, not good idea. Fudge me. There's lots of them. Can I go through? No, nope, I cannot. No. Gunpowder it is. What the hell? Well... Alright, before I do anything, let's just, um... Can I go to my... R2? No, I don't want to do the map. Nope. How do I choose my... There we go, triangle. So, let's craft again. Um, I can't get in there because it is locked. I don't want to. Why are these arrows here? Ah. Uh. 
This is not funny. Oh my lord, really? How does one actually get to... Why are the arrows? Where are they all coming from? This is ridiculous. Oh my lord, they're, they're, they're in here as well. They could just, oh. I just got to keep running. Uh. Oh, hello. Tell me I'm not dead. <laughs> okay. What's going on? He's a big one, isn't he? Chris? He can't be. Your face. <laughs> what is it? I, I'm so lost. So, so lost right now. Oh, so they were firing at me. Well, oh, and... Who's that? Ooh, trophy. Not liking this. Very funny. It's my kind of joke. All right, so before I do, I've got some buildings that I can actually explore here. Um, so, how many bullets have I got left? I've got none. Let's swap with. I've got a knife. I've got a fair amount here. What did I miss in here? Shogu? Okay, so let's just reload. Ooh, we can at least hold four, that's good. So that's that. Chem fluids. One herb. Um, what is my health? My health is really poor right now. Hmm. Let's just heal myself. Ugh. What is in here? Explosive barrels, attack red barrels to create a massive explosion. Well, maybe I, I did this really poorly. What's that? That's just a... Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Bear with us a second. 
I think my internet is about to bug out. Right, bear with us a second. Right, back again. How do I get out again? Oh yeah. So, is that... Yes, okay, that was done. Um, straight ahead. Hang on, what's that? Mechanical door. Hello. Um, no, there's still something in here. Aha. Nope, still something in here. It's got to be downstairs. Unless this isn't part of the building. Behind, ooh, plant, does that count? Nope. Hmm. Th that doesn't count, does it? These things. Unless, th no. Yeah, that's that side. It's full of flat, is it? No. Is it to do with the mechanical door? But I don't know where the mechanical door is. No, I don't want to do that. Ah, that's why. Hang on, Emma. Okay. And we are... Yes, we're back to blue. All right, we're good. And that one's good. So the only building there is that one. We're not going to leave this area until it's done. Um, it's behind us. The one we came out of.
Really? I thought I've got everything. Oh well, we're just gonna have to just accept the fact that we're not gonna grab anything here. We'll probably have to come back here again at some other time. So let's move on. Show your face. You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? We're hey, drawing on the floor. Can you hear me? Oh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose! Yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming! <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again! <laughs> okay, well, that's freak. Freaky? New houses? New houses. I need a torch. <laughs> God. Easy to pick a lock, okay. Uh, oh, great lichens, the fabled monsters, wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh. May they come to tear us apart. Well, that's lovely. What a lovely poem of death. Can fluid. All right, all right, all right. I see, what is our health at the moment? I forgot to look, uh, wrong button. Triangle. Hmm. Uh, I'm assuming that's going to stay red because I need to lockpick that one. So I won't necessarily know if I've grabbed everything else. Um, nah. What else is there? Is the... Let's go over that way, shall we? The Maiden of War. Uh, view map. Lovely. Is that a gate? Look from the other side, it is a gate. Can I go? Nope, can't go underneath. I'm assuming also that anything yellow is able to be used. It needs some kind of other item. Uh, oh, nope, can't go through that door either. Rusted scrap. What do we need the rusted scraps for? I can't remember what we needed for them last time. Upgrades? Goat. Oh, hello. Uh, we offer these goats to a uh, warding to protect the village of its pe uh, and its people. Any who break them shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. So they're like the bobbleheads. Um, 
don't particularly want to do that just yet. I'll probably do that towards the end, maybe. What's this way? Okay, I'm going to a graveyard. That's not really where I wanted to be. I think I might want to go around this way. Uh, old West Town. But we're here, so we'll have a look. Yes, it does open. Hmm. More symbols. That's the same symbol as last time. Don't have a key. Don't have bolt cutters anymore, I don't think. I need the crank or whatever it is. And it does let me through. Okay, is this where I came in? It is. Let's have a look inside. It's a church. Of course, it's a church. Maiden's Crest. Okay. Um, church here. We should should disaster fall upon the village. Seek out the crests. One is in the care of the church. The other is in Louisa's house. So we do need to go east anyway, in the east town, I suppose. Yeah, looks like it. Typewriters used to save your progress. We will not use it just yet. Hmm, I recognise that one. Can't say I recognise anything else though. Okay. Um, in which case, let's see if I can go through that way. Scarecrow? Or well, actually something scary. Fallow plot. I'm wondering, is that the house there? Let's see. Uh, I can't get to that house there. I don't think I want to be this way yet. Yeah, they, that doesn't look good. This this place doesn't look good. I don't want to be here yet. This is this house here is the one I was looking at, wasn't it? Yeah, this is the one. There's a well, there's a gate, which probably says I can't open it. Hmm. This place does not respond to me. Well, we would have to go that way. Well, this sucks. Hmm. We are being funneled. Fine. Let's see what this area's got to do for us. What's this? Oh, hello. Right, so, which one did I grab? Do, do, do. Items, crafting. So it's the face, the fa- Yeah, this is the one I want. Gosh. What am I doing here? There we go. Is that it? Oh, there we go. And that is the hour. Um. Okay. Well, before my internet cuts out, this leads to the castle. Yeah, it does. Uh, before the internet cuts out, I'm gonna give my my verdict. Um, feels a lot like the other one, but it feels like you've got into the game a lot, like a lot quicker. I do feel powerless. I don't know what that bit at the start was all about, but, or what I needed to do to 
survive. Maybe it was just literally just just don't shoot my don't shoot any of them. Just just get hurt. Um. Yeah, I'd like to see uh, what other people have done on that part. Maybe maybe it's just literally just wait until your your pain gets down to a certain threshold and then it's like your pain your health gets down to a certain threshold and then it uh, it kicks in could have saved myself some ammo I don't know probably but uh, yeah I uh, I like it it's very good very good feels very very much like the first game and the fourth game kind of like a mix of the two uh, as well as the viewpoint of the seven I did like seven I thought it was the first half of seven was great really good but uh, yeah Anyway, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. But it's a recommendation from me. I did buy this at about, I think it was about forty-eight pounds. So, um, wasn't at full price. I'm happy with my purchase. I'll probably play this to the end and platinum it fairly easily. Um, yeah, I've heard other people do the same. But yeah, it's a good one for me. I I, I like it. I would recommend. Hmm. Yeah, I'm also definitely a, a Resident Evil fan. So. It's the kind of uh, it's it's my kind of game, but uh, anyway, thanks very much for watching, guys. Um, we'll see you next time. Cheers.